Look at that. Look at that. A walk into the video. I'm naming this video one hour of video games. Because I gave myself one hour and thir three minutes, not five minutes, three minutes of video games today. But Apex Legends exclusive. I, don't, I only play Apex and I used to play all for them on the side as well. Sorry, I'm seeing some trash in my room. I'm just going to put out half them. But that was previously how I played games, just those two games, Warframe, Apex, that's it. I will branch off Siege, I'll branch off Minecraft, I'll branch off here, branch off there. But in all actuality, I never um, stuck. The only game that I really stuck to was Warframe and Apex. Much more so Apex. And upon my return, I thought to myself like, yeah, I'm not good at this game. I'm not good enough to play this game professionally. I'm not good enough to play this game at the pro level in which I could actually make some money. I'm not good enough to play this game for even content creation like Fade. I'm not good enough. I don't hit 20 mobile 4 ks consistently. I have the basis expectation myself. I need to at least hit 3 ks. I need to be hitting 4 ks. I should be hitting 20, bomb 20 bombs. And I watch videos, I study, I'm rigorous, I ruthlessly try to improve, I put in the fucking hours. YouTube takes down my streams, I just private all my streams. I said, like, fuck it, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna risk it anymore. Hurry. Like, they already taken out my best stream when I almost got that 3k on stream. I was 107 damage off, I was at 2,893 damage, which is exactly 107 damage off 3,000 damage. I could have got 4,000 damage that game had I played it differently. I, if I thirsted some of these kids, if I milked some of these kids more at the end game, if I did that, I would have been at a 4k. It was just 1,107 damage off. I've got 700 and I think 790 games a season, so like 800 and something, 780 games a season, season 17, and I've also got 40 wins, which is horrible, 5% win rate. Ow! Hit my head. Ow, that hurt. Uh, it's not looking good, bro. Bruv, it's not looking good, bruv. You know, a girl who used to like me, I think she has some more feelings for me still. She used to say bruv a lot. I wonder where she is now. Oh yeah, she has a boyfriend now. And she put it on a story and really trying to make me jealous, but yeah, I didn't like her at all. Like I friends on her. And I just think it makes me think back like, what would they think of me now? I don't even like her, but I value her opinion. I value everyone's opinion, to, to be honest, which is not good because then I'm seeking validation from other people. It's relevant to this video, but I, I guess that validation thing, I really wanted the validation of hey, I got 3k, hey, I got 4k, hey, I got 20 bomb. I really want that validation. Not only do I want to achieve my goal, I want that validation from other gamers within the gamer space. And I wanted to know, like, hey, I got it. No, it's not, I still got it, I got it. And I want to know. Like, yeah, if you want to go pro, I can go pro. Like, I always say, you, you do video gaming as a career, all right? But like, the amount of hours you put in, and what if you're, like, you're just simply not good at the game? Like me. Like, how are you going to be professional in Apex if you're just, you're just not good enough at Apex? Like, what the fuck? How are you going to play Apex if you're not good at Apex? Uh, professionally, at least. You're not Verholz, you're not TSM Imperial Hell, you're not Asu, you're not Fade. Even Asu and Fade can't keep up in comp. Competitive gameplay. How are you going to keep up in competitive gameplay? Like two teams. I could say that are fucking, are copying in fucking comp, and are doing semi decent. Like, I could say Optic, I could say TSM, I could say NRG, three teams. The big two teams obviously are NRG and TSM. Like, how the fuck are you gonna compete with that, bro? The juggernauts. They play games eight hours a fucking day. It's just Apex. Apex, Apex, Apex. Just eight hours a day. Apex, Apex, Apex. 
How are you going to compete with that? I mean, you can. For sure. You're good enough. But if you're good enough, then. Say goodbye. I think within the first thousand games, you should be able to tell if you're good or not. In your first 10,000 games, I'm not, I'm not there yet. 5,000, 10,000 games, I'm at 6,000 games. You should tell if you're good or not. You should be able to tell. If you don't have 20 more 4 kids at that time, 10k games, you don't have Apex Predator, Master or something, then you should just quit. Yeah. One hour of video games I do it myself. Now one hour. I think it's going to be my final hour. I'm dead serious. I'm thinking of giving away my PS4 to... Because I can't really sell it. I'll take pictures and try to sell it. But, um... I doubt anyone wants to buy it. I'll, I'll for sure take pictures. But I, you, I gotta be realistic in the sense, like, who the fuck's gonna buy a used PS4 in 2023? No one. My controller's drift. It's just... I, I'm not fond of it anymore. I don't want to play games anymore. I'm all brain dead. That frustration means nothing. I'll be in my eyes. What's in my eye, bro? I look like shit. <laughs> You know, I woke up with immense vigor today. I woke up with an insane amount of vigor. I woke up with this burning passion, this burning desire to become better, to become stronger, to become more financially accomplished. I, I saw, I heard my mom saying, hey, I'm going to work today. Have a nice day. I couldn't even say have a nice day back. I was that sleepy. I was that fucked on my sleep. How am I going to achieve anything if my bare, if my bare basis of sleep is not good enough? I'm not going to achieve anything. That's the reality. That's pissing me the fuck off. It, it, it made me angry enough. This is why I, I think anger is a phenomenal source of uh, energy and anger is a phenomenal emotion to have. Because if you have anger and you direct it towards people you love, then that's stupid anger. But if you have anger that, that you direct towards yourself and you become better as a result, then that's good anger. Because I wouldn't have gone out of that bed. If it wasn't for anger, if it wasn't for me being angry in my situation and me intensely, intensely desiring to become better, become stronger, it become more fiscally and financially fucking um, accomplished.
gonna walk up. Anyway, guys, I got new boxing boots. You like them? They're really nice, in my opinion. I truly believe that you just need an hour of video games and you're done. Like any more is just inviting lunacy, inviting brain dead away. You know, I, I, simultaneously the envy and dislike the people that can go and play like just, just one hour a day, right? Because it usually always ends up bleeding over. This is why Hamza says, hour oh, video games, shut the fuck up. I know. You don't play an hour of video games, that's what Hazard says. Um, but yeah, I, I truly believe that there's some individuals out there that just play an hour of video games a day. I am not one of those individuals. I play for hours and hours on end. I see my entire day evaporate while I'm playing the game. And, and I can imagine Hamza was like that as well, which is why he's so mad. I am like that. You know, video games, they manipulate, they ruthlessly manipulate. There's intense desire to achieve, to become great, to become strong, to become accomplished, to get validation from your brothers in arms. Bro, I get off the video game, I don't talk to a single person in the video game, and I don't care. I doubt they care as well. I don't talk to a single person. It is. I have hundreds of friends, hundreds of followers. I don't talk to a single person after I get off the video game. You know what? I don't care. It's not fucking real. I think this is my last video games video for a while. Every single time it's my last. I need to fix my videos. I need to fix my life. I need the, my um, life is shit or reflection video. I think like I always end up fixing myself up just a bit more. And I think this is going to be my last video on video games period for a very long time. And I think that's because I'm tired of the shit. I'm gonna give. I can't sell my PS4. I'll give my PS4 to my cousin. I'm 18 soon, in 5 days, I don't want to continue spending my time, my youth, in the virtual world, especially if I'm not working in the virtual world, to make me money back, or give me something consistent, like, if I'm doing something like that, then what the fuck's the point, bro? Think about how many young men, young women, even, 
the game would go epidemic these days. I just strung out, hooked to this shit. Hooked to this video game, bro. Right now I'm copying my files. I'm not even saying. Get my files over. I don't think there's much else I need to say. I think I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Let me know, die.